Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel. And uh, this is a question that comes from a viewer. I've uh, talked about this a long, long time ago. And uh, we're going to actually look at this option both on Windows 10 and Windows 11 separately. As, uh, you know, the settings are not exactly the same on each machine. So on Windows 10, um, if you have some type of visual disability and have a hard time maybe, um, you know, seeing... Um, or reading the screen because the contrast isn't good or maybe you're colorblind or you know all sorts of problems can arise that makes it tough for um, some of you to use your PC. If you go into your start menu, go into the settings app, there you will go to ease of access and two options that you can check out for um, the um, visual disabilities is the color filters first of all so color filters when you turn them on will have different options that you can have inverted grayscale um, which removes all color from the screen uh, grayscale inverted you also have uh, for color blindness filters um, red green um, or red green with um, red weak and so on it's, it tells you the type of disability a blue yellow and there's actually a wheel on the bottom that shows you <clears throat> the colors going to be displayed and these are only colors that are going to be used so that means that if you use that you will see that everything on your screen is way different uh, because it's going to follow these color filters you also have the high contrast mode on the left side where you can turn on high contrast and this takes a little while because your computer will adapt the high contrast and once you're there you will see that there's a different teams uh, so here I have my theme and then there's high contrast one you can you know play with that change the contrast of everything um, and so this could help you also in certain situations and everything on your PC will follow the high contrast mode that you've selected and of course, the on-off switch will trigger and toggle, um, you know, on and off in the contrast modes. And so all you have to do is select the correct modes that you want to use in these options. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.